A proposed upscale waterfront community condominium project is now in jeopardy. A 212-unit project was supposed to be built off of US-41, just south of the Anna Maria Oyster Bar, but now its future hangs in the balance. ABC 7's Bo Beth Yates is joining us live tonight with more details on this. Bo Beth. Well, right now I'm off US-41, not too far from the proposed development. And as you can see, SRQ Airport is in the background. That very fact is why that proposed development now hangs in the balance. Now, developers were hoping to transform this vacant 12.4-acre lot off US-41 south of Bolas Creek into luxury condos called Blue Harbor. The gated community would have lush landscaping, island-inspired architecture, as well as array of amenities, including a private yacht, boat club, fitness center, pools, boardwalk, fire pit, boat docks, literally the works. But critics say the proposed four-building high-rise could help or could impact have a negative impact on planes taking off and landing in the area because it sits about eight stories high. The reduction in the safety envelope uh, would greatly reduce the amount of uh, a maneuvering room for aircraft especially in either thunderstorms or when they're uh, having one engine that goes out or, or a bird strike those types of things or an inexperienced pilot so we had a great deal of safety concerns. Now, the Planning Commission agreed with that thought, voting unanimously to deny the proposal. But the Blue Harbor condominiums aren't done yet. They still have to be voted on by the entire commission. But it's very unlikely that the commission would vote for something the planning board has gone against and also that the airport authority has come out against. 